February 1985. Dr. Zephyr Kerman, working late one night, noticed a peculiar effect of docking port magnets, how they tended to pull things closer together, and later wondered what would happen if they were held apart. After testing in the hangar, this effect from the magnets became known as Zephyr Kerman crack and drive. The first mission for this type of drive launched into space on December 25th, 1995. This mission was to prove that the engine not only works in the atmosphere to decrease fuel consumption, but also in the vacuum of space, attempting to make fuel stations a thing of the past, something the fuel companies lobbied very hard against. Using a decommissioned booster from a partly reusable MUN rocket, and the leftover service module of a previous rescue mission that was cancelled due to it being unnecessary, this mission was literally a last minute rush job due to lobbying of fuel companies. Upon reaching booster separation, the payload fairing deployed and they extended the nacelles to stabilize the magnetic field of the drive. Dr. Von Kerman, though hardly scientific, noted in his report that the nacelles looked very cool. After the deployment, the drive was used to raise the orbit to just before escape velocity of Kerbin, using nothing but the Kraken drive, proving that perpetual motion and reactionless drives are possible. While it may be possible, the propelling companies like Xenon Fuel and Dunico have made it clear that they will not let this happen anytime too soon. Upon reaching Apogee, the pilot Zeb Kerman turned the ship around and noticed how small Kerman looked in the starry backdrop of the universe, saying, are we alone? What is next for us? And will we ever find other life? A few hours later, the ship re-entered the atmosphere and parachuted down safely in the forest of Kermany, later being recovered and repaired for display in the Global Air and Cosmos Museum in Kermany, standing proudly and elegantly next to the first liquid-fueled rocket ever launched.
If you liked this video and want to see more of this, please like, subscribe, and share your thoughts on what you want to see next in the comments below. I release a new video every week for your viewing pleasure. I am the Astronaut. Crash softly.